Welcome to EFOX number one stop to entertainment and trending news. Now, earlier on, we had shared that Edith had hinted that Karen Yam was not in the U.S., specifically Massachusetts. This is because Karen had shared a photo of herself with a jumper with Samido's name, putting out Samido, the true African son, and her location was Massachusetts. This is the same location that Edith has been sharing while she is still in the U.S. And people started to say, Kwani, my baby, my kutana, Massachusetts. Others were saying, Karen, where were you? And she questioned, ni mechokoza nani? And when somebody decided to take that screenshot of Karen in Massachusetts, Edith decided to indicate that Karen is not there. She's just posting throwback photos. As you can see, this is what someone had shared. Team Karenzo marketing our territory is our greatest achievement. Kwani ni kesho. And Edith responded, territory you say, ama ni territory ya kuwa side chick na vinyo mkowengi. Na kwani proof ni TBT photos. And you can see Edith laughing. So we can clearly tell or maybe confirm right now that a day before yesterday Karen was not in Massachusetts she was still very much here in Kenya as today she took to share that her family that is her together with her daughter and Samido went to their son's sports day where even Samido was very very active and she also shared a very uh, hilarious caption which she put out sports day at my son's school and I'm a bit concerned because he completely refused used to be number two and rejected his number two medal. He tabia ya opposition to Nakemea. And it seemed to have been a very fun-filled day. Samido was also taking his fatherhood duties seriously, participating. Let's have a look at that. <laughs> And so as you can see, they really enjoyed their sports day that is Karen Nyamu, Samido, their son, and also Karen Nyamu's daughter. Now the big question is why? Why did Karen Nyamu tag or put that location that she is in Massachusetts, knowing very well that Edith is there? Is it true that what people are saying, Karen Nimchokozi, and why do you think she continues to do this, even though it is very much now in public knowledge that she has Samido, she is with Samido, they go to events together, like this time around, Zile Mambo za kuficha fichwa zimeisha, we know that she is with this man, but still she continues to put these things up. Could it be that Edith Nomchokozi labbed her behind the scene and Karen Nyamu is the one who comes and puts it out publicly? Because in this case, it is not Edith who started throwing words until somebody brought a photo of Karen Nyamu and then she decided to react to it. From the look of things, they will not stop throwing jabs at each other. Remember, in um, the previous upload, uh, Edith had also indicated that she does not consider them as a family. So perhaps there is a type of resistance or or perhaps the things that she does that we don't get to see publicly that has made Karen Yamu continue to throw jabs online even when Edith has not pushed her buttons publicly. Perhaps behind the scene, there is so much that we don't get to see that makes Karen Yamu throw these jabs online. Anyway, what do you think about this? Do you think that Karen Yamu no Hucho Kozwa and she just decides to put everything out in the public or it is Karen Yamu Ndio Mucho Kozwa? Anyway, that's it for up today. Thanks so much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't for this more updates. Hit your notification bell so you'll be the first to be notified once you have any new uploads. Catch you on the next one. Bye-bye.